another great interview segment from the Racing Insider Show. You know, Jeff, we talk a lot about team orders here in the United States, but at Audi, it's not a big thing. And the DTM, uh, Mike Rockefeller's championship, came with a little help from some of his Audi teammates, Timo Scheider in particular, who kind of protected him uh, to get finished second and get that championship today. Let's get a little from Mike Rockefeller, the 2013 DTM champion. Uh, DTM champion 2013, how does that sound to you? Uh, sounds not too bad, I would say. Uh, we were fighting for that, we were hoping and aiming for it, and uh, now finally we made it. You know, it's one race before the end. We can be proud of ourselves. Uh, everybody in the team, uh, Phoenix, Audi, myself, uh, the sponsor, Schaeffler, it's great, you know, for them as well. So, great day, and uh, we should celebrate it. Um, well, it was tough, you know, uh, it was not easy. I was uh, struggling a bit after the start and I passed Wittmann uh, in the first lap and I tried to catch Augusto, which uh, was good. Then uh, on the standard try, I was just losing performance. You know, I have some very personal memories myself of Mike Rockefeller. I was doing some work with the Grand Dam Rolex Series in 2007. We were at uh, Utah at Miller Motorsports Park. A guy sticks a note in front of me and says that uh, the note says that Colin McRae had died in a helicopter crash. Mike Rockefeller was in the booth with me. We were doing an interview and we shared a little bit about our memories of Colin McRae and that will be with me forever. That's Mike Rockefeller is a very special person because we shared that moment together. And uh, I remember also when he was at the Rolex 24, I don't know, maybe 04, 05, in a Porsche, I think it was for Flying Lizards, and he made up like 20 minutes in the, his last stint in the last hour or two of the race, uh, threw it around the track like he was in a Hot Wheels car. Kids playing, made up enormous time, just an incredible drive. Mike Rockefeller, the 2013 DTM champion. Jeff, you have any memories of a great driver like that? Actually, if you want to go way back to him, I remember watching him at Indy Motor Speedway when Formula One was there, and he was racing the Porsche Super Cup and won that series for the year, was the number one Porsche driver in the world, and I watched him race at Indy Motor Speedway in Porsche Cup. Mike Rockefeller, the DTM champion for 2013, he'll get a chance to celebrate a little bit at Aachen on the final round in a couple weeks of the DTM. The Racing Insiders on MAV-TV every Thursday at 2 and 5 o'clock Eastern and again on Saturdays at 12.30 midday. It's the season of giving, so before we go to our next segment, let's talk about your investment in us and our investment in you, how we give to each other through the Racing Insiders. Go to our Indiegogo page, our crowdfunding page, and you'll get a chance to participate in gifts from our marketing partners, including GoPro cameras, fan experiences at the Tudor United Sports Car Championship, and the Pirelli World Challenge. This is with the Mazda Owners Group, iRacing memberships, and gifts from Trackmate. There's many more there. So go to the racinginsiders.com slash Indiegogo. Participate in an investment in your favorite sports car racing show.